Hi everyone, Ivan Desjardins with Remax. I just want to give you a quick update on the market and uh, a few things also that I wanted to touch base on and tell you how you can get some home show tickets uh, for the home show that's coming up in Toronto. Uh, first of all, let me give you the, the sales of what's going on uh, in real estate wise in Halton Hills. This again, these numbers are all for Halton Hills com uh, combined, which is uh, country, Acton, Georgetown, everything. And uh, if you go back uh, last year, we had 54 sales coming out of the gate in uh, in January. This year, we're at 34 sales. So we're definitely a little lower in terms of, of uh, activity. But however, the prices are pretty stable. Last year, we're averaging 694, uh, 694,000 per household price. This one here last year was 683. Um, sorry, in reverse. This year 683. Last year 694. So we're pretty very very close in terms of of price. It could be maybe that uh, a few higher price homes or less uh, lower price homes have sold that it plays with the price a little bit. But if you go back 2016, the average price was 606. So as you can see, we've averaged now about $100,000 more per home in Halton Hills. With that said, this year we have, uh, see, sorry, the sun is in my face this morning. It's, it's very, very strong. So that's why I'm trying to get closer to the computer here. But uh, this year, right now, uh, we only have 72 homes total, 72 homes uh, in all of Halton Hills, which is a quite low numbers as you can see so I think the new mortgage rule has played the fact that I know a lot of people have already bought in last fall and uh, or maybe now they're just maybe a little cautious about the interest rates or there's a lot of people that are saying um, I can't put my house up for sale because I can't find what I what I need so it's a little bit of a catch-22 right now I think a lot of people are in the position of saying let's wait and see what's going to happen but um, if you're thinking about selling your home this year, I would say do it a little sooner than, than later. You will have maybe less competition. And as you can see, the prices are still very, very good. Also, I've got some interesting stats here. Um, this has been pulled by an, an independent um, research company. And this gives you the amount of real estate agents that are on the Toronto Real Estate Board and the amount of transactions per agent. And interestingly, uh, there's 50,000 real estate agents on the Toronto Real Estate Board. And did you know that 35, about 35% 35 did not sell one house last year in 2017? And less than two houses, 51%. So all to say that there's a lot of real estate agent out there but not everyone is actually active so in order to go to let's say 15 transactions in a year uh, this is this is 95 percent of the agent 95 percent of the agent do not sell 15 homes in a year that is quite substantial and um, so all of this I'm bringing this to you is because if you're hiring an agent it's nice to say that you know you're, you're, you want to use your friend because you know like he's in real estate and all that stuff but use someone that's professional that makes it their career that makes it their 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 life to sell real estate um, maybe I'll give myself a little tap on the back here I've sold over three, 1300 homes in my 30 years so when you're hiring someone like me that sells quite a few properties in a year uh, you're getting a lot of experience that comes to the table not just someone that sells one or two houses a year or sells none so I'm not discrediting these people that are that are that are doing this I mean if they're doing it part-time it's fine but however I think if you want to protect your investment you want to know you want to have the best for you it's like maybe like getting the specialist versus the maybe the, like the regular doctor so ask your agent how they're doing and uh, those numbers are available and if you would like to have them I certainly would share them with you uh, also before I go we have the, no the national home show tickets I have some nice Remax VIP tickets uh, here's how to get them just 
reply to this video or send me a quick email. I'll gladly send you, uh, you know, a couple of tickets or maybe four if you're going with uh, your, one of the family members. I'd be glad to uh, share some uh, uh, with you. In the meantime, have a great day. And uh, again, if you're uh, out and about and you hear someone that needs to book real estate, think of me. Maybe just uh, pass along my name and uh, phone number. I'd be glad to help them out. Again, have a great day. Thank you.